So I just figured out how to bridge my EVAX from P chain to C chain. I'm gonna do just a very quick tutorial here on how to go ahead and do it if you were curious. What you're gonna wanna do, of course, C chain, by the way, you, the reason you wanna do it is because C chain is where AVAX interacts with pretty much everything. P chain is just for L1s and validators, which most of you don't really care about. So we go to core.app, make sure you're on the right website. And then we're gonna wanna connect our core wallet. After you connect said core wallet, you're gonna have your account here. I'm gonna blur out, of course, all my stuff. You're gonna press this stake thing on the left hand side and press cross chain transfer. After doing that, on the source chain, we have the P chain, because that's the one we're transferring out of. And then on the destination chain, we have the C chain. You're going to want to put the amount of AVAX that you want to transfer. And then, of course, press the export button, import button. You're done. You're done after that. Something you should know, a bit of a tr problem I had was it gave me an RPC error. That's because I only had the extension on whenever I clicked on the website or whenever I clicked on the extension. You want to set it to always be on. That's the only way it's gonna allow you to actually interact with the RPC. So if you're having that error, that is why I had the error and you're done. AVAC C chain.